as you can see the thumbnail it says uh, we are discussing actually current affairs for IFT the upcoming IFT exam which is supposed to happen on 18th December so we have done just one class at 7 p.m and now we are again doing it at 9 p.m a revision series so if I'm audible and visible just write in the comments yes sir you're audible so that we can start our session okay so <laughs> I'll be giving you questions these are one-liner questions you have to answer it and then we'll move fast okay well we will move fast so that we can cover in less amount of time we will cover a more number of questions right so the first question says which of the following muse museums has been awarded the highest award of excellence at unesco asia pacific award for cultural heritage conservation 2022 and your options are jahangir art gallery tara Puravala aquarium chhatrapati shivaji maharaj vastru sangrale dr bhau daji lad museum what is the right answer answering it or a coach is with an eye where is the headquarter of UNESCO yes a match the following boost a so the right answer is Paris which is the capital of France okay yes what is the right answer to question number one so the right answer is Chhatrapati Shivaji Vastu Sangrale so C is the right answer yes Guru Pasad Ashni Hundiwala you all are right Nihar Amrita Abhina from app is also right yes <clears throat> Yes, uh, the next is after defeating which of the following countries Canada has won their first 2022 Davis Cup held in Malaga, Spain. Your options are Australia, New Zealand, South Korea, Spain. Yes, Nikita Tekriwal. Uh, we try to ensure ki thoda se different questions hai. Some questions might overlap but mostly we try to come up with new questions. Take it, huh? So question number two, what is the right answer? <clears throat> the right answer to this question actually is A, Australia is the right answer to this question. So Canada defeated Australia A is the right answer Ashni, Sai Pradeep, you all are right. Let's move on to the next one, the question number three. So question number three says, who among the following sports personality has been appointed as national ambassador of TB Mukt Bharat Abhiyan? I hope you are aware of TB, tuberculosis, tuberculosis, which is a very deadly disease. Okay. And there is a vaccine for it called as BCG vaccine. And uh, at world level the target is to be eliminate tb by 2030 this is world level target yes but india's target is even five years before that is 2025 so india's target is that we should be eliminating tb by 2025 india ka target is ki 2025 tb ko eliminate so is the brand ambassador yes deepa malik uh, yes harsh guru Pasad, ashwani real uh, state modit khodidas mayank sani and Abhinav Nihara and Swagnik from app are also right. Uh, the next one is question number four. Ministry of External Affairs has announced uh, that India has invited Abdul Fattah Al Sisi as the chief guest next year. This is very, 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 very important. Let's go star lagal of them. External Affairs Ministry, Minister of India, Mr. S. Jayashankar. Right? Yes. So, Abdul Fattah Al Sisi will be the chief guest of the next Republic Day that is going to happen on 26 January 2023. So, he is the president of which country? Yes, very good. He is the president of Egypt. D is the right answer to this question. I hope you all are aware. Harsh, Fadidas, Education, KS, Guru Pasad, and Abhina from App. One more thing you should be knowing it recently, Egypt conducted COP27, Conference of Parties 27, at Sharmal Sheikh. Sharmal Sheikh is a city in Egypt. So just have an idea about it. You can ask this is important. Hai. COP27 hua. Conference of Parties. And this Conference of Parties are done under UNFCCC, United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change. So this COP27, which is the COP1, 2, 3, this is UNFCCC in the center. Mein hota hai. UN Framework Convention on Climate Change. Hai. So D is the right answer. Yes. Uh, the next one is as per Forbes India Rich List 2022. What is the combined wealth of top 100 richest people in India? Forbes India Rich List, you understand? It's a magazine. Forbes, very famous magazine. The 100 richest people of India. That combined total wealth is how What is the right answer? <coughs> it came in the news. Huh? So the right answer to this question actually is, yes, uh, D is the right answer. $800 billion is the right answer. Yes, Abhinav, Amrit, uh, Amrita, you all are right. Huh? Education World, KS, you all are right. Khodi Das. The next is in December 2022, which of the following countries received financial assistance of 100 million US dollar from India? These types of questions are being asked. Hai? 
मलेशिया इंडोनेशिया मालदीव भूटान दिसंबर में 100 मिलियन यूएस डॉलर फाइनेंशियल असिस्टेंस इंडिया से लिया है सो द राइट आंसर एज ऑप्शन सी मालदीव इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन सो सी इज द राइट आंसर यस निहार अभिनव जयदेवी मोदी बंसाली यू वाला राइट द नेक्स्ट इज इन दिसंबर दिस ईयर हु हैज बीन अपॉइंटेड एज ब्रांड एंबेसडर ऑफ उत्तराखंड ब्रांड एंबेसडर वगैरह पूछते हैं कई बार यस हां सिक्स का सी वाज द राइट आंसर सेवन का आंसर बताओ व्हाट इज द राइट आंसर गाइस यस प्रशांत माइक यू ऑल वेरी राइट सेवन का आंसर बताओ so the right answer is d prasoon joshi is the right answer to this question so d is the right answer just have an idea salman khan is not from uttarakhand so chances kam hi tha b c mein option ho sakta hai because these two are also from uttarakhand uh, these two are actually from i think himachal right hai na salman khan is born in indore madhya pradesh as far as my knowledge is concerned so ye to hona nahi chahiye na so yes the right answer is d huh? modit mayank prashant shyoti jayadev you all are right ha huh? so uh, the next one is uh, Nirogi project an initiative for health in which free checkups will be provided to the enlisted antodaya population is by launched by which state antodaya antodaya matlab uh, the you can say the most uh, you can say poorest of the poor so ha ha okay so the right answer to this question is option a haryana is the right answer to this question so just have an idea about it huh? yes okay Uh, the next is Jiang Zemin, who passed away, was a former leader of which of the following countries? Okay, what is the right answer, guys, to this question? Uh, yes, uh, he is very important because of many reasons. First, uh, he was the first Chinese president, first Chinese president to visit India. Okay, and he was the president of China from 1993 to 2003. he came to india i think in 1996 visited taj mahal and all theek hai so just have an idea about it this becomes important is wajah se ye pooch sakte hain ki first chinese president to visit india is tarah ka ghuma ke de denge so just have an idea about it the next is uh, name the indian platform that has been awarded nseit best tech initiative of the year award at doon and brad street business excellence award 2022 so what is the right answer guys paisa bazaar manthan government e marketplace my gov So the right answer to this question is actually Manthan. So B is the right answer to this question. Yes, Kodi Das, Prashant, Kavya. Yes. Uh, B is the right answer. No. So the next one is question number eleven. Question number eleven says on fourth December twenty twenty two, which of the following states observed sixtieth edition of Statehood Day? Meghalaya, Nagaland, Sikkim, Odisha. What is the right answer? Yes, ten ka B was the right answer. Eleven ka answer batao. 60th edition of statehood day so the right answer is b nagaland is the right answer to this question 1963 mein na nagaland became a separate state hai na so b is the right answer yes just have an idea about it yes b is the right answer uh, the next one is ha uh, kishor mittal you all were right or na b you all were right so b is the right answer to this question yes The next is Sudarshan Prahar is a military exercise conducted by Indian Army Sudarshan Chakra Corps in which of the following states on November 30 Uttarakhand Rajasthan Gujarat Himachal what is the right answer so ye jawab bataiye iska so Sudarshan Prahar is a joint military exercise is a military exercise conducted by Indian Army in Rajasthan so b is the right answer education world is right yes b is the right answer नहीं निकिता यू शुड वॉच मोर देन सिक्स मंथ्स आई थिंक टेन मंथ्स तक एट टू टेन मंथ्स पढ़ लेना तो ज्यादा बेटर होगा ठीक है बट यस गिव मोर फोकस ऑन लास्ट सिक्स मंथ्स एंड इफ यू हैव टाइम एक्स्ट्रा थ्री मंथ्स आल्सो यू कैन वॉच हाँ द नेक्स्ट इज अलॉन्ग विद एयरलाइन इजी जेट विच आर द फॉलोइंग ऑर्गेनाइजेशन है सक्सेसफुली टेस्टेड वर्ल्ड फर्स्ट हाइड्रोजन रन एयरक्राफ्ट इंजन योर ऑप्शन आर पैट एंड विटनी इंग्लिश अलायंस जी हॉन्डा एरो इंजन रॉल्स रॉयस वॉट इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इसका सही जवाब क्या है यस एनी वन यस द राइट आंसर इज रॉल्स रॉयस तो ये इस तरह के क्वेश्चन पूछ सकते हैं बिल्कुल दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन दे आस्क रिलेटेड विद इंडस्ट्रीज एंड ऑल्सो रॉल्स रॉयस एंड एयरलाइन इज इज सो डी इज द राइट आंसर यस एजुकेशन वर्ल्ड के एस अभिना फ्रॉम एप यू ऑल आर राइट हाँ डी इज के एस यू ऑल आर राइट द नेक्स्ट इज अकॉर्डिंग टू द रिपोर्ट टाइटल प्राइम मिनिस्टर ग्लोबल सिटी इंडेक्स क्यू थ्री क्यू थ्री मतलब क्वार्टर थ्री है ना फिजिकल ईयर में दे आर फोर क्वार्टर्स 
अप्रैल मई जून इस फर्स्ट क्वार्टर जुलाई अगस्त सेप्टेम्बर अप्रैल मई जून जुलाई अगस्त सेप्टेम्बर इज क्वार्टर टू एंड आई थिंक दिस इज शुड बी क्वार्टर टू देन जुलाई सेप्टेम्बर जुलाई टू सेप्टेम्बर पब्लिश बाई नाइट फ्रैंक विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग सिटीज ऑफ इंडिया हैज बीन रैंक ट्वेंटी सेकेंड रैंक इन ग्लोबल इंडेक्स है ना तो ये क्यू टू होगा ना जुलाई अगस्त सेप्टेम्बर इज क्यू टू तो बाईस रैंक किसको मिला है वॉट इज द राइट आंसर यस द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन एक्चुअली इज ए मुंबई इज द राइट आंसर यस साहिल प्रशांत यू ऑल वेर राइट हाँ अमृता अभिनव निहार यू ऑल आर राइट कृष्णा पांडे इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन दिस इज द नेक्स्ट वन द क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टीन इन नवंबर 2022 द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया हैज अमेंडेड दिस पीएमएलए एक्ट देखो एक्ट से सवाल आया है इफ यू सी द आई एफ टी प्रीवियस क्वेश्चन दे हैव आस्ड क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम पार्लियामेंट्री लॉ ऑल्सो ठीक है Prevention of Money Laundering Act. So ED works under it. ED का आपने नाम सुना होगा Enforcement Directorate. Its job is to actually curb money laundering. So earlier it was supposed to share the information with uh, some agencies. So there were X agencies. Now 15 more have got added. So now we'll be having Y. So total now Enforcement Directorate can share information with how many agencies? So earlier there were 10 agencies with which it can share. 15 has been added. Now it has it can share with 25. ठीक है. So B is the right answer to this question. ठीक है. So just have an idea about it. Yes, Sahil Singh, very good. Ashni, uh, you all are right. The next is uh, Khodi Das Ashni, you all are right. Which of the following states, union, territory has organized first of its kind tribal winter festival to boost the tourism and employment? Your options are Ladakh, Jammu Kashmir, Bihar, Assam. What is the right answer? First Tribal Winter Festival. ठीक है. देखो Tribal Winter Festival, Winter वगैरह कहाँ ठंड में पड़ता है, बिहार में तो ना पड़ता नहीं है, है ना? So what is the right answer? Yes, the right answer is B. Jammu and Kashmir is the right answer to this question. Yes. So B is the right answer. ठीक है. Yes, Khodi Das, Krishna, Prashant Gupta, you all are right. The next is which of the following institution has been conferred Rashtriya Khel Prothahan Puraskar 2022? ये अवार्ड किसको मिला है? And these are your options: Netaji Subhash, a National Institute of Sports; Tamil Nadu Physical Education and Sport University; Swarnam Gujarat Sports University; Kalinga Institute of Technology. What is the right answer? Everyone, guys, please press the like button. सबको लाइक बटन प्रेस करते जाना। फटा फट। We are seeing only 15 likes, so at least 40 plus likes. Let's go. Sab koi pata pata. Yes, the right answer is D. Kalinga Institute of Technology. So D is the right answer. Yes, Modit Bansali, you all are right. Jay Devi, D is the right answer. The next is in December 2022. Which of the following beverages company has signed an agreement with Adani Digital Lab for product sampling and developing deep consumer insights? इस तरह के पूछते हैं ना mergers, acquisitions. Agreement between two uh, companies. Is there a question? Push them. So yes, this is important. Ha. Huh? Which beverage company that does drinks? Bagara banati hai na. So the right answer to this question actually is uh, it's a D. Coca Cola is the right answer to this question. Yes. Uh, Shizid Mittal, uh, Mudit Mansali. Yes, you all are right. D is the right answer. D. Coca Cola India. Okay. The next is which of the following state government has launched one district one sport scheme? To promote sport culture and larger talents of sports person, Odisha, Madhya Pradesh, UP, Bihar. What is the right answer? So, uh, anyone? Yes. Uh, the right answer to this question is UP. It has also come up with one district, one product scheme also. Okay. So C is the right answer. Yes, Prashant Gupta, Akshat Gupta, K S Education World. You all are right. Okay. Nehar, you all are right. Uh, the next one is uh, a book titled Chipko Movement: A People's History. Was has won 2022 Kamla Devi Chattopadhyay NIF Book Prize. Very important. Hai. Of course, this can be asked. Na. Who is the writer of this book? So Chipko Movement was started by uh, in modern times. It was started by Sundar Lal Bahuguna. Hai na? He died last year during COVID second wave. Bahuguna. Uh, he was from Uttarakhand. And uh, chipko movement means means to protect felling of trees. So they used to go and hug the tree, right? Hai na? Yes. Uh, the right answer is D. Shekhar Patak is the right answer to this question. So he has written this book about chipko movement, and it has won Kamla Devi Chattopadhyay and a book prize. So D is the right answer. Yes to this question. Okay. 
the next one is which of the following countries has assumed the charge of presidency of UN Security Council for December. Yeh important hai. I hope you are aware UN Security Council is having five permanent members, ten non-permanent members. And recently, uh, which country actually in December has taken the presidency of UN Security Council? And uh, this is important. Why? Because the answer is India. So that is why it becomes important. So first star mark. Kar lena. Yes. Ha, 20 ka D was the right answer. Rohan Narola, you all were right. 21 ka answer C. Education world. Harsh Vijay, Mudit, Prashant, Sahil, you all are right. C is the right answer. Amrita, yes. C is the right answer. Uh, the next one is as per minister. There was a option. Kar rahe the, isse pehle wala. Wo G20 summit hold kiya tha is saal. Indonesia. Ne. So do not get confused. And I'm saying that December mein who has become so in UN Security Council president is for one month. Thik hai, ek mahina ke liye hote so India is, will be the for one month. Thik hai, this year, December. Okay, the next one is as per external affairs ministry, or you can say foreign ministry, both are the same thing. India will assume charge of chairmanship of Vasinar arrangement for, for a year on what date? So Vasinar arrangement is related with actually an agreement related with um, curtailing biological weapons and all those related okay g20 summit was hosted this year in bali indonesia rohan narula please connect correct yourself this year actually it happened in november in bali next year in 2023 it is going to happen in new delhi in india okay yes Okay, uh, the right answer to this question is the C. First January 2023 is the right answer to this question. Okay, Amrita is right. Yes, very good. Huh? Prashant Gupta, you all are right. Home oh, the following has become the first female referee. Yes, this is the key word in the competition of 92 years history at men's 2022 FIFA World Cup Qatar. Abhi World Cup chal hai Qatar mein. I hope you are aware. Okay, so they can ask question what is the mascot of FIFA World Cup? Ye sab what is the motto of FIFA World Cup? These things we have discussed at 9 p.m. session, right? Uh, then first female referees there in men's World Cup. So this is a good question. Yes. So the right answer is yes. Very good. The right answer is Stephanie Prapot. Yes. Prashant, Akshat, KS, Education World, Krishna, Kodi Das, Sahil, Rohan, Narula, Amrita and Akshata from app is also right. Shruti Maurya, you all are right. The next is which of the following ministries has launched or organized a pre launch event of International Year of Millets? So please remember it. United Nations General Assembly has declared next year 2023 as International Year of Millets. And it was on the initiative of India. India has initiated that the International Year of Millets declared. Kiya jai. So Millet Smart Nutritive Food Conclave in New Delhi on December 5, 2022 is being organized. So by which ministry? So the right answer is Ministry of Commerce and Industry. Yes, uh, B is the right answer to this question. Yes. Okay. Education World, Modit Bansali, Jayadev, NK, you are right. Uh, the next one is who among the following has been appointed as the part-time chairperson of National Statistical Commission of India for three years? Bimal Jalan, D. Subbara, or Rajiv, Lakshman, Karandikar, Urjit Patel. What is the right answer to this question? Kya se jawab hai? What is the right answer? Uh, the right answer to this question is option C. Rajiv Lakshman Karandikar is the right answer to this. Yes, Prashant Gupta, you are right. Or uh, he was ex he was the RBI governor. He was RBI governor during demonetization, right? In 2016. And then later on he resigned and all. Right now, I think he was appointed the vice president of one of the vice president of Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank, AIIB. Please remember it. Asian Infrastructure Investment Bank Vice President is Urjit Patel. Uh, 25 ka answer C hoga. Thik hai. Yes. So just have an idea about it. Okay. Yes. I am giving you additional knowledge also. Thik hai. So the next is question number 26, which is in front of you. Yes. This is question number 26. Read it and then answer it. Uh, the uh, 25th National Conference on E-Governance was held in which state union territory recently? So these are the recent questions. So the right answer is Jammu and Kashmir Union Territory. Okay. So B is the right answer to this question. Okay. 
Uh, the next is how many Indian institutions have been featured in 2022 Global Employability University Ranking and Survey released by Times Higher Education. Five, six, seven, eight. Kya si job hai? Yes, uh, the right answer to this question is C7 is the right answer to this question. Yes, Amrita is right. Huh. Yes, Krishna Pandey, yes. Which of the following earned the top rank in Global Employability University Ranking and Survey report released by Times Higher Education Ranking? What is the right answer? Is the answer without? Yes, the right answer is 28K Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Prashant Gupta, Amrita, uh, you all are right. Is the right answer. Uh, the next is according to World Intellectual Property Indicator released by WIPO, World Intellectual Property Organization, which two countries are top with highest number of patent fillings? Your options are Japan and US, UK and Germany, India and China, France and USA. What is the right answer? Yes, the right answer is C, India and China is the right answer to this question. Yes, Abhina, Vamrita, you all are right. The next is who has been bestowed with prestigious Tenzing Norgay National Adventure Award 2021 or an outstanding contribution in the field of land adventure? Yes, Education World, you all are right, Vanshika, yes. Uh, the right answer to this question is D. Naina Dhakar is the right answer to this question. Okay, but D is the right answer. Okay, uh, the next one is uh, question 31. Who has been conferred with the most prestigious Dr. Abdul Kalam Seva Puraskar for his steadfast service to the society? Ravi Kumar Sagar, Avinash Madat, Ram Tulsi, Tushar De. Yes, what is the right answer? The right answer is A, Ravi Kumar Sagar. Yes, Prashant uh, Gupta, you all are right, is the right answer. Yes. Okay, the next is who has been conferred with the insignia of Chevalier d'Or National Du Merit. Uh, this is a France award given by France. Okay, what is the right answer? Pile S. Kanwar, Rohini, Godbale, Raman, Ganga, Khedkar, Sujoy, K. Guha. Everyone, please press the like button, guys. The like button press because at least 50 plus likes there should be. Anna. So, the right answer to this question is A. Payal S. Kamar is the right answer to this question. Okay. Yes, A is the right answer. Okay. Hmm. okay. Uh, the next is who is the author of the book title? Game yeah, is important. The Paradise of Food. Star Market. Originally written in Urdu but translated in English. It has won JCB Prize for Literature. You can ask this star. Yes, the right answer. Kabibo Gitanjali Shri. What is the right answer to this question? Yes, Prashant Gupta. Very good. Khalid Javed is the right answer. Amrita from app is also correct. Uh, yes, Khalid Javed. Please remember it. It's important. Hai. Star mark kar lena. Pooch sakte hai, bilkul. Under whose chairmanship a committee has been set up to recommend structural and other reforms required in the rural job guarantee scheme under M. Manrega. Yeh to bhoat hi important hai. So this is a uh, scheme which provides legal work, legal right to work. Hai na? In rural areas, so you will get a chance under Manrega scheme, you can work uh, 100 days of uh, unskilled work uh, in rural areas. So uh, this is actually a job guarantee scheme, uh, employment guarantee scheme type. Uh, it is a very famous Manrega. Uh, so 34 ka the right answer is D. Amarjit Sina is the right answer. So Amarjit Sina committee has been set up uh, uh, to find out any reforms required in Manrega. Okay. Amarji Chennai is former ICE officer, Bihar cadre. Anna. Yes, uh, Amrita is right. D is the right answer. The next is, uh, yes, yeah, this is important. Anwar Ibrahim has sworn in as the new Prime Minister of which country? Indonesia, Malaysia, Pakistan, Oman. What is the right answer? Kya si jawab hai? Everyone, please press the like button. Sabko like button press karte jana. 50 plus likes at least. Yes, at least 50 plus le jau. Yes. Uh, the right answer is Malaysia. B is the right answer to this question. So, Malaysia is the right answer. Okay. 
अच्छा इसका करेंसी क्या है गो एंड फाइंड आउट रेंगिट करके इस तरह ना इंडोनेशिया का रुपया है पाकिस्तान का तो रुपी है यू नो दिस है ना तो बी इज द राइट आंसर यस मोदित शुभम फरजाना यू आर राइट अच्छा एक चीज और पूछ रहा है वॉन्ट टू आस्क इंडोनेशिया हैज कम अप विथ इट्स न्यू कैपिटल सो करेंटली द कैपिटल इज जकार्ता बट इट हैज डिसाइडेड टू कम अप विथ न्यू कैपिटल वॉट इज द न्यू कैपिटल ऑफ इंडोनेशिया नूसन तारा पता होना चाहिए ये पूछ सकते हैं एग्जाम में ठीक है पानी के नीचे से जाएगा केबल यानी इंटरनेट कनेक्शन एंड ऑल हाँ बी एस एन एल एम टी एन एल ग्रुप भारतीय एयरटेल जियो वॉट इज द राइट आंसर हाँ इंडोनेशिया की नया कैपिटल मनुसंतरा वेरी गुड हाँ मुंबई कोची कोलकाता वट इज द राइट आंसर Yes, the right answer is B. Mumbai is the right answer to this question. Okay, B is the right answer. Okay, let's move on further to the next one, the question number thirty-eight. Which of the following institution has developed a system named Sindhuja I to generate electricity by using energy from sea waves? Thirty-seven. Ka B was the right answer. Thirty-eight. Answer. Batao. 38 का ए इज द राइट आंसर आई आई टी मद्रास इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन ठीक है ठीक है ए इज द राइट आंसर निहार फ्रॉम एप इज राइट एंड आकाश अक्षत गुप्ता सिद्धि जोशी वाला राइट द नेक्स्ट इज विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग कंट्री हैज स्टॉप्ड यानी गॉट रैंक वन इन ग्लोबल एविएशन सेफ्टी रैंकिंग दैट इज रिलीज बाई इंटरनेशनल सिविल एविएशन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एविएशन यू अंडरस्टैंड हवाई जहाज एरोप्लेन एरोप्लेन सेफ्टी वे टॉकिंग बॉट है Who has got rank one? So the rank one is D. Singapore is the right answer to this question. Probal Hazwari is the right answer. Uh, has answered it correctly. Prashant Harsh Vijay, you all are right. Uh, D is the right answer. The next is uh, what is India's rank in this index? So India's rank actually is forty-eight. So just remember it. Huh? So rank one is Singapore, and India's rank is forty-eight. Krishna Pandey right. Nihar, you all are right. B is the right answer to this question. Yes, Harsh Vijay, Prashant Gupta, you all are right. Uh, the next is question number forty-one. In December, Foreign Affairs Minister, or you can say External Affairs Minister, Mr. S. J. Shankar, signed an agreement on a comprehensive migration and mobility partnership with which country to help citizens of both the nations to study, do research, and work in each other's country? France, Canada, Germany, USA. What is the right answer? Say your answer. Yes, the right answer is C. Germany is the right answer to this question. Prashant Gupta, C is the right answer. Yes, ha. Shubham Sharma, Gaurav Rohan, Krishna, Khodi Das, you all are right. C is the right answer. Ha. Anshita. Uh, the next is question number forty-two, which says, name the Indian or origin person appointed as the first Vice President and Chief Operating Officer of Federal Reserve Bank USA, with effect from March twenty twenty-three. स्वाति गुप्ता सुष्मिता शुक्ला ऋषि अगोनी ए आर अनुराधा एवरी वन प्लीज प्रेस द लाइक बटन फिफ्टी प्लस लाइक्स ले जाना सबको फटाफट यस यस द राइट आंसर इज बी सुष्मिता शुक्ला इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन बी इज द राइट आंसर यस के एस इज राइट हा द नेक्स्ट इज यस एजुकेशन वर्ल्ड खोदी दास यू आर राइट गौरव देवा यस In December 2002, according to the Forbes magazine, who among the following has replaced Tesla's Tesla CEO Elon Musk to become world's richest person for a short period of time? So Elon Musk, who is the CEO of Tesla as well as CEO of Twitter now also, uh, is generally rank one. But recently, someone actually defeated him. So who is that person? Yes, so the right answer is Bernard Arnold and family. So C is the right answer. Yes, Shubham Sharma, Rohit, Prashant. 
Sanyukta Abhinav, you all are right. C is the right answer to this question. Uh, the next one is Bhumang the following has been awarded Spirit of Cinema Award 2022 at 6th, 27th edition of International Film Festival of Kerala held in Trivandapuram. So these are your options. Ha, Gaurav Deva, right? Ha, Louis Vuitton ke founder. Ha. Ha, Ritesh, right now, fair ho gaya. Ha. Yes, I. 44 ka answer, what is the right answer? The right answer is Mahnaz Muhammadi. So D is the right answer to this question. Ha. Prashant, you all are right. Nihar, ha. Achha, who is this lady? Mahsa Amini. She died, actually. I hope you are aware. Uh, her death led to anti-hijab protest in Iran. I hope you are aware of this lady also, Mahsa Amini. That can also be asked. Ki, what is the name of the girl who died and because of which the anti-hijab protest started? So the name of the girl is Mahsa Amini. Okay. Uh, before moving on, guys, there's a small announcement. So on 18th December at 4.30 p.m. we'll be having a SNAP 2022 test 2 exam analysis, exam pattern, section wise analysis, difficulty level, good attempts will be discussed. So please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that whenever we are putting a video, you will get the notification. And similarly, after the IFT exam is over, after uh, I mean 2.30 p.m. on 18th December, we'll be having exam analysis. So subscribe to our channel, press the bell icon. Let's move on further to the next one. The question number 45 is in front of you and it says along with INS Kochi and INS Kavarakti, these are the name of ships. Okay. INS means Indian Naval Ship. Hana. Which of the following Indian Navy ships has participated in first international fleet review that was organized in Cox at Cox Bazar. Uh, it's a port uh, of Bangladesh near Hana. So what is the name of the third ship? So three ships actually participated in it. Okay. So the right answer is option A, INS Sumeda. INS Kochi, Kavarati and INS Sumeda. Yes, Prashant, Krish, uh, Education World. You all are right. Huh? Parzana Ramsan is the right answer. Huh? Rohan Narula. The next is 46. Who among the following has been appointed uh, by Government of India as the Chair of B20 in India? An official G20 dialogue forum with the global business community. B20 with the business 20. Yeah? Rajesh Gopinath, N. Gatpati, Subramaniam, Fakir Chand, Kohli, N. Chandrasekharan. What is the right answer? Kya sahi hai? So the right answer to this question is option D. He is the chairman of Tata Sons. And before him, the chairman was Cyrus Mistry. So 2012-16, Cyrus Mistry was chairman. Uh, I hope you are aware of Cyrus Mistry. He recently went with, met with an accident and died, unfortunately. So after him, actually, in 2016, Anjana Shekharan became the Tata Sun's chairman. Yes, D. Parzana, Rohan, Shobham, you are right. So D is the right answer. Uh, the next is question number 47. Who among the following has been named as chairman of NABAD, National Bank for Agriculture and Rural Development? Amalur Pavanathan, Surya Kumar, PVS, Lokan Das, KV Shadi. What is the right answer to this question? Yes, the right answer is KV Shaji. D is the right answer to this question. Nabad ke jo director, uh, chairman banayenge, KV Shaji. Uh, the next is, yes, very good. Yes, Kavya Kostov and Rohan. Yes, Gaurav Deva, right. Haan. Yes. His father also died in July. Cyrus Mistry's father. Yes, Niha, right. Haan. Which of the following state cabinet has approved formation of Safai Karamchari Commission? So the right answer is Assam. C is the right answer. You can just have an idea. Uh, the next one is in December. After the impeachment, impeachment is a process to remove a president of a country. And I hope you are aware. Pedro Castillo, uh, you can say, of president of, you can say, Peru. Peru is a country in South America. Anna. Impeachment of Pedro Castillo, who has become the new president of Peru. So what is the right answer? 49 ka? Yes, uh, the right answer to this question actually is D, Dina Bulotre. Yes, Education World, Prashant, Rohan Narula, you all are right, D is the right answer to this question. Okay. Siddhi Joshi, you all are right. The next is in December, Dina Bulotre has become the first female. Yes, ye yaad hona ki she has actually become the first female president of Peru. Okay. So, ye pooch sakta hai, first female president. So, ye match the following way. So, star laga lena is par. Okay. 
यस रोहन नरोला राइट हाँ वेरी गुड सो लेट मी शो यू वेर एग्जैक्टली इट इज यहाँ पर इंडिया है है ना सो इफ यू सी लेट मी रिमूव माई सेल्फ दिस इज साउथ अमेरिका ठीक है एयर यू विल फाइंड पेरो है ना एंड दैट इज वॉट वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट और यहाँ पे एक पतला सा कंट्री चिली चिली के भी नए प्रेसिडेंट बने हैं रिसेंटली वन ऑफ द यंगेस्ट वन गैब्रियल बोरिक वाई एम डिस्कसिंग चिली एंड इट्स कैपिटल इज सेंटियागो वाई एम डिस्कसिंग चिली बिकॉज रिसेंटली एक्चुअली इट्स इट केम अप विथ अ न्यू कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन इट्स कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन असेंबली कॉन्स्टिट्यूट असेंबली नेम ऑफ केम अप विथ न्यू कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन बट इट वॉज रिजेक्टेड इन रेफरेंडम बाई द कॉमन मैन इन रेफरेंडम रिजेक्टेड द न्यू कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन आई होप यू आर अवेयर ऑफ दैट इसीलिए चिली भी पता होना जरूरी है ठीक है ओके यस लेट्स मूव ऑन फर्दर टू द नेक्स्ट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टी वन द फॉलोइंग बीन अपॉइंटेड एज चेयरमैन एंड मैनेजिंग डायरेक्टर ऑफ ओ एन जी सी ऑयल एंड नेचुरल गैस कमीशन वेरी फेमस है ना द राइट आंसर इज डी अरुण कुमार सिंह इज द राइट आंसर यस हर्ष विजय वेरी गुड डी इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन एनी वन फ्रॉम एप यस अमृता राइट डी इज द राइट आंसर प्रशांत गुप्ता एजुकेशन वर्ल्ड यू आर राइट द नेक्स्ट इज हाउ मेनी इंडियन वुमेन हैव बीन लिस्टेड इन 2022 ट्वेंटी टू फोर्स एनुअल लिस्ट ऑफ वर्ल्ड हंड्रेड मोस्ट पावरफुल वुमेन फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन कितनी इंडियन फीमेल है बताइए कितनी भारतीय महिला है इसमें Yes, the right answer is C. Six is the right answer to this question. ठीक है. So uh, Indian women, six Indian women are there. Uh, like Falguni Nayar, Roshni Nayar, Adar Malhotra, Nirmala Sitaraman. So as far as uh, ha, Falguni Nayar, I hope you are aware she is from Nike Fashion, बहुत famous है है ना. Roshni Nayar, Adar Malhotra, HCL company से है ना. HCL laptops वगैरह बनाती. Nirmala Sitaraman is the honourable finance minister of India. I hope you are aware of that है ना. सब पता होना चाहिए आपको. Yes. So C is the right answer. Yes. Uh, yes. Very good, Rohan and all. This may be C answer. Yeah, you all are right. Huh? The next is who among the following topped Forbes annual list of world's hundred most powerful women? So six Indian hai, female top hundred me. So who is rank one? And these are your options. Anyone? Christian Lagarde, Kamala Harris, Maria Bera, Ursula von der Leyen. so the right answer is actually d she is actually the president of european commission so i have told you european union is a 27 member grouping hai na so it has commission called as european commission so the head of that commission is called as president of european commission and ursula von der leyen so please remember it ha a uh, inko european union chief bhi kabhi kabhi likh diya jata hai sometimes it is written eu chief so just remember it d is the right answer yes rohan narula you are right I am sure enough. Many people would be thinking, sir, Kamala Harris on a thing, but no, I think she is on third or fourth rank. So the right answer is D. Okay. So rank, uh, yes. The next is woman. The following has become the seventy-seventh chess grandmaster. Uh, grandmaster is related with chess, of course. During Ilo Brigat, Ilo Brigat Open tournament held in Spain, and these are the options. What is the right answer? Hey, job, yeah, guys. Yes, the right answer is Aditya Mittal. Very good, Prashant, Harsh, Vijay, uh, Akshat. You all are right. D is the right answer to this question. Ha. Education world. This, uh, the next is in December. ISRO has signed an agreement with which of the following organization for the Space Tech Innovation Network? Your options are Social Alpha, Symposium, Simulation, Vayu, Vayu Yantra, Vasundra Geo. What is the right answer? Yes, Abhina, you are very right. Ha. नहीं गौरव देवा अर्लियर यूरोपियन यूनियन है ट्वेंटी एट मेंबर्स बट वेन ब्रेग्जिट हैपन ब्रेग्जिट मतलब ब्रिटेन एग्जिटिंग फ्रॉम यूरोपियन यूनियन हैपन नाउ वी आर हैविंग ट्वेंटी सेवन नेशन इन यूरोपियन यूनियन ठीक है सो द राइट आंसर इज ए सोशल अल्फा इज द राइट आंसर फिफ्टी फाइव का ए इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन ठीक है द नेक्स्ट इज वोमेन द फॉलोइंग इंडियन वोमेन हैज नॉट बीन इंक्लूडेड इन टू टॉप हंड्रेड इन्फ्लुएंशियल लिस्ट दिस इज नॉट फोर्स लिस्ट दिस इज अ बीबीसी लिस्ट आई एम सींग So actually, four Indian female are there in top hundred influential women according to BBC. I'm not saying Forbes. Forbes wala chala gaya. We have already discussed. Now we are talking about BBC. So there are four Indian females. Which of them is not in that? Uh, what is the right answer? So the right answer is Nirmala Sitaraman is not there. So D is the right answer. Not pooch rahe. 
so there are four people uh, my priyanka chopra jonas priyanka chopra very famous bollywood actress uh, srisha bandla uh, she is also a, i can say aviation uh, engineer or aeronautical engineer hai na geetanjali shri uh, her book tomb of sand actually won recently uh, what uh, tomb of sand won international booker prize hai na ye aapko pata hona chahiye these are very very important hai na and the last one is social worker sneha jawale so these are the four indians in top uh, bbc's top 100 women list theek hai theek hai so this is the right answer uh, the next is 57 sir aap kbc jo thank you sahil <laughs> everyone please press the like button sabko like button press kar do fatafat sydney maclaughlin lebron i don't know the pronunciation uh, she has actually been named 2022 world athlete of the year at world athlete award तो शी इज एसोसिएटेड विद विच कंट्री कौन से कंट्री से बिलोंग करती है आपको बताना है ठीक है यूएसए ऑस्ट्रेलिया न्यूजीलैंड नामीबिया सो व्हाट इज द राइट आंसर गाइस हां सब कोई लाइक बटन प्रेस करते जाना गाइस फटाफट हां एवरीवन यस द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन एक्चुअली इज ए यूएसए इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन ठीक है ए इज द राइट आंसर ठीक है शी इज फ्रॉम यूएसए ओके द नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन 58 यस रोश रोहन नरुला यू आर द राइट जिन्होंने अभी ए किया सही है हां Who among the following has been appointed as acting Chief Justice of Jammu Kashmir High Court? Uh, so the right answer is Justice Ra uh, Tashi Rabistan. Okay, so ये उतना important नहीं आपके लिए, so I'm skipping it. Uh, the next one, yes, this is important. In which category Indian weightlifter Meera Bai Chanu won silver medal in weightlifting championship organized in Bogota, Colombia? 49 kg, 67 kg, 53 kg, 60 kg. She won silver medal last year in Olympics also. टोक्यो ओलंपिक्स में आई होप यू आर अवेयर एंड इन वेट लिफ्टिंग ऑफ कोर्स है ना यस द राइट आंसर इज शी इज इन 49 केजी कैटेगरी वेरी गुड एजुकेशन मलक पोदी दास रौनक के एस अंचल निहार अभिनव फ्रॉम ऐप आल्सो यस द नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर 60 ये पूछ सकते हैं ये आपके लिए इंपॉर्टेंट है योगेंद्र के अलग पास द वेरी रिसेंटली एट द एज ऑफ 83 ही वाज एन इमिनेंट व्हाट साइंटिस्ट इकोनॉमिस्ट मैथमेटिशियन आर्कियोलॉजिस्ट What is the right answer? Uh, there is a very famous committee, Alak Committee. So this was actually set up to recommend the um, poverty line or measure of poverty line, poverty estimation committee. Okay. Very famous. If you read economics, if you are from economics background, you will get to know. Okay. Alak Committee ke naam se padte hain log. So B is the right answer. Yes. Sai Pradeep, Krishna, Shubham, Harsh Vijay, Sahil, Nihar, Amrita B is the right answer. Uh, the next one is how many Indian billionaires were listed in 16th edition of Forbes Asia Heroes of Philanthropy list? Philanthropy मतलब uh, you can say charity है ना? तो so, CSR वर्ग जो होता है corporate social responsibility ये सब तो जानते होगे ना CSR corporate social responsibility है ना? So the right answer to this question is actually three Indians were there in this list and uh, philanthropic list में so these are uh, Gautam Adani. HCL technology shiv nadar and uh, and uh, then ashoka suta and is uh, actually the founder of happiest mind technology okay so three log the so d is the right answer yes prashant you all are right ha huh? amrita yes uh, the next one is question 62 who what word has been selected ye important hai ye sab puchte hain exam mein what word has been selected by oxford english dictionary for 2022 oxford of the year word oxford word of the year these are your options oxford word of the year yes uh, the right answer is yes uh, b goblin mode is the right answer to this question theek hai yaad rakhiyega harshita b is the right answer people are asking me sir when the admit card will be released so i'm very sorry <laughs> even i cannot say this theek hai aap wait karte raho theek hai सत्यांश जैसे ही आएगा एडमिट कार्ड फॉरन प्रिंट आउट निकलवा लेना उसका व्हेन रीड द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ एडमिट कार्ड ठीक है कई बार चेंज कर देते हैं इंस्ट्रक्शन कुछ नया रूल बदल देते हैं तो जैसे ही एडमिट कार्ड आए तो इंस्ट्रक्शन गौर से जरूर पढ़ लेना ठीक है और प्रिंट आउट तो निकलवाना ही ओरिजिनल आईडी वगैरह लेके जाना ठीक है ओके द नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर 63 हु अमंग द फॉलोइंग इंडियन ओरिजिन टीचर हैज बीन कंफर्ड विद प्राइम मिनिस्टर्स प्राइज फॉर एक्सीलेंस इन साइंस एंड टीचिंग इन सेकेंडरी स्कूल इन ऑस्ट्रेलिया इंडियन ओरिजिन टीचर को ऑस्ट्रेलिया में अवार्ड मिला है फॉर डेमोस्ट्रेटिंग प्रैक्टिकल एप्लीकेशन ऑफ स्टीम स्टीम क्या होता है 
साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी इंजीनियरिंग आर्ट्स एंड मैथ्स है ना ये होता है ना तो उसको हम लोग स्ट्रीम शॉर्ट में लिख देते हैं टू स्टूडेंट्स क्या वट इज द राइट आंसर यस वेरी गुड बीना नायर राइट प्रशांत कृष्णा पांडे अमृता यू आर राइट डी इज द राइट आंसर एजुकेशन वर्ल्ड के एस सिद्धि जोशी माला क्यू आर राइट हाँ Uh, the next one is question 64 in december this year which of the following football club has signed a two and a half year agreement with cristiano ronaldo for 200 million euro per season so he plays actually for portugal right hana uh, matlab in world cup so we are talking about which football club actually uh, has signed him so the right answer is d al nasr football club fc matlab football club so d is right. yes amrita um Prashant Gupta, you all are right. This is the right answer to this question. Okay. Okay. Uh, the next one is yes, uh, Education World, Satyan, Rohan, Narula, you all are right. After commissioning a 450 megawatt wind solar hybrid plant in Jaisalmer, Jaisalmer, you will get in Rajasthan. Which of the following renewable energy companies has become largest operational hybrid generation with a capacity of 40 or 1440 megawatt? He denied it. Okay. हाँ तो अच्छा हाँ please correct it. Uh, actually news में आ रहा था ना तो please correct it. कि he denied it. हाँ thanks for. तो यही पूछ लेंगे कि he denied home. तो तो यही answer में लिख देना ठीक है. They may ask कि Cristiano Ronaldo denied the offer of which company हाँ ठीक है. Okay yes uh, the right answer. Thanks for correcting me. हाँ uh, the right answer to this question is C. Adani Green Energy is the right answer. ठीक है. Yes. Mudit, you all are right, huh? Panchal, yes. Uh, the next is who among the following has become the new prime minister of UK? Take a Boris Johnson was the prime minister of UK. Boris Johnson was the prime minister because what what was the reason why he had to resign? He had to resign because of Chris Pincher scandal. Chris Pincher scandal. ये पूछ सकते हैं. So he had to resign. I think in October he resigned, है ना? So in October, a new one was appointed the prime minister. Her name was Liz Truss. She became the third female prime minister, female PM of Britain or England. Okay. And hardly, I think, for 45 days she was the prime minister, and after that she had to resign. And now we are having Mr. Rishi Sunak as the prime minister of England. Now uh, the question is, he belongs to which political party? Is it possible? So he belongs to Conservative Party. Can we ask this too? And conservative party is also called as Tories. So Tories we write it. Tory or Tories. So just remember it. And he is son-in-law of a very famous businessman. What is his name? Son-in-law of Mr. Narayan Murthy. Who is Narayan Murthy? So Narayan Murthy is actually the founder of Infosys. Founder of Infosys. Yes. ये सब से सवाल आ सकता है. बिल्कुल घुमा घुमा के कहीं से क्वेश्चन दे देंगे. ठीक है? So just be aware of it. Haan, he was finance minister before it, right? Haan, Nihar, right? Haan. Finance minister was treasury secretary. We are about use. Karte hai, lekin haan, hai, haan. Nee, Narayan Murthy is not from Wipro Abhinav. He is from uh, Infosys. Wipro's founder is Azim Premji. Please correct yourself. Hai, na? Yes, Prashant Shubham, you are right. Kartik Sisodi, you are right. Uh, the next one is who among the following has been named the brand ambassador for third World Cup T20 World Cup for blind. Hai, so, blind World Cup. So, for blind people. क्रिकेट मैच हैपेंस ठीक है अब देखना गुरु गुरु वाले मैच में जाके दे आल्सो प्ले ठीक है सो हु हैज बीन अपॉइंटेड द ब्रांड एंबेसडर सुनील गावस्कर सचिन तेंदुलकर एमएस धोनी युवराज सिंह हां चांसलर ऑफ एक्सचेकर कहते हैं फॉरेन मिनिस्टर गोइंग इंग्लैंड में यस कार्तिक सिसोदिया वेरी गुड हां यस द राइट आंसर इज मिस्टर युवराज सिंह ही इज द पर्सन हु हैज हिट सिक्स सिक्सेस है ना ठीक है सो ही इज द सेकंड पर्सन टू हिट सिक्स सिक्सेस इन सिक्स बॉल आई होप यू आर अवेयर so we are having three people who have hit six sixes and six balls so first person is harshal gibbs second is yuvraj singh and the third one is last year kiran pollard hai na kiran pollard please check the spelling i think kiran actually likhte hain from west indies theek hai harshal gibbs was from south africa ha so this is the right answer yes uh, the next is which of the following states has backed the first position at pradhan mantri awas yojana awas yojana means housing scheme housing scheme 
और एक्चुअली प्रधानमंत्री आवास योजना आइडिया वॉज हाउसिंग फॉर ऑल बाई ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू सो दैट वॉज द टारगेट दैट बाई द एंड ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू एवरी वन शुड है saying sir ravi shastri also hit 666 he hit it in uh, not in international matches theek okay, it was not an international match so isil ravi shastri is not counted at international level ha huh? yes shobham ha huh? so the right answer is d up is the right answer yes ha huh? abhinav uh, amrita yes farzana education world aditi ha huh? yes d is the right answer ha na up bat stop on right pradhan mantri awas yojana housing development and he is mr uh, hardeep singh puri he is a former ifs officer hardeep singh puri he is actually minister of housing and urban affairs m o h u a we write like this theek hai okay uh the next one is best performing union territory award under pradhan mantri awas yojana kisko diya gaya jammu kashmir new delhi dadra and nagar haveli and daman and do daman and diu ya d theek hai देखो ये एक यूनियन टेरेटरी दिस इज अन यूनियन टेरेटरी अर्लियर दिस वी आर टू डिफरेंट बट आई थिंक इन 2019 बोथ गॉट मर्ज सो द नेम ऑफ यूनियन टेरेटरी इज दादरा एंड नगर हवेली एंड दमन एंड डू एक पूरा एक यूनियन टेरेटरी है ये ठीक है सो द राइट आंसर इज डी मतलब जम्मू कश्मीर यूनियन टेरेटरी एज वेल एज दिस यूनियन टेरेटरी ठीक है यस अक्षय फोदी दास दी इज द राइट आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन ठीक है krishna pandey yes a uh, 91st edition of interpol general assembly 2023 happened where will happen so 98th ka jo hua tha this year 98th interpol interpol means international police ya yeah, international police organization it is hot headquarter in lyon france why i am highlighting this because this year 98th session which happened in 2022 happened in delhi in pragati maidan in india theek okay? hai india mein hua tha So the next one is going to happen in Austria, Vienna. Austria's capital is Vienna. So C is the right answer. Please be crystal clear. Yeah, Austria नहीं है. Austria है. This is in Europe. Australia is a different country. Austria is different. ठीक है? थोड़ा सा का फर्क है. People get confused. Yes. Aditi, Sina, Fazana, Krishna, Aditi, Anchal, Amrita, Abhinav, you all are right. C is the right answer to this question. Uh, let's move on to the next one. This is very, very, very important. ये एकदम पूछ सकते हैं एग्जाम में. इसको star लगा लेना. A businessman, a Dietrich. Max is I don't know the pronunciation. I'm very sorry. Uh, he has passed away recently. He was the founder of a very famous Formula One racing team. Formula One racing team means car race. Formula One, जानते होंगे आप, है ना? बहुत सारे लोगों ने देखा भी होगा, हाँ. So what is the right answer? Yes, very good, Prashant Gupta. Very good. ये बहुत important है. इससे संभाव संभावना है question पूछने की. Yes, Prashant, Education, Modit, Krishna, K S. हाँ, the right answer is Red Bull founder. Uh, Red Bull का तो energy drink भी आता है ना हाँ. I hope you are aware of these things है ना. Gaurav yes. So Red Bull uh, founder actually passed away at the age of 78. ठीक है. So just have an idea about it है ना. So he was from Austria. ये भी Austria से है ना. Energy drink इनकी company है है ना. Red Bull तो drink भी होता है ना एक हाँ. And car racing team also there. So this is all about today's class guys. I hope you would have enjoyed the session. Please press the like button. Everyone सबको like button at least. 70 plus likes or 100 plus likes should be there hai na subscribe to our channel follow us on instagram facebook download the byju's exam prep app thank you everyone thanks for watching have a nice day